Hello everybody and welcome to Romanceville's Tarot. I'm about to begin here with a reading. Now this reading here is for August 18th, 2020 and it is for the sign of Capricorn. That being said, it's a general reading so it might not resonate with everybody. So please do take whatever resonates with you and just leave the rest aside. If it doesn't feel right with you, then most likely it is not meant for you. That being said, if ever you would like to have a personal reading, you're searching for answers, you're searching for guidance, please do contact me at romancefultarot at gmail.com. You can also scroll down right here at the YouTube Dropbox and you will find all the information you need. You will find the different types of readings, the price list, and how to contact me and how to go upon doing a booking. So if you are interested in a reading, please do verify the messages in the YouTube Dropbox. Also, on another note, if you do enjoy my channel and you have not yet subscribed, please do take a brief moment to click the subscribe button to show your support, show your encouragement to my channel and to myself. It would be mostly appreciated. Also, after this reading, please do stay tuned. I do have another reading that is coming out, which is a message from your fairy godmothers, and it's a love reading. So please do stay tuned for that. So with no further ado, let's begin this reading now. Let's go all the way over here. And I have the card of Observer for you. Now the Observer is all about perspective. It's about objectivity. It's about neutral observation from a distance. Now, most people see the world through a personal lens. They closely identify with their feelings and their experiences, so much so that they come to believe that these are the only realities that they have. There are times when you need distance in order to gain perspective and understand your circumstances from a more neutral vantage point. Now is one of those times in your life. This is a perfect moment for you to begin to do some exploring. Instead of only considering yourself, consider what you need to understand about the conditions, about the people, the culture, and environment that you're engaged with now. You'll be so happy you did. Illumination is the miracle you seek and you will indeed find. Sometimes you just can't see the forest for the trees in your way and feelings can get all kind of jumbled up and often you hear one thing when a person says another. It can be like an echo of an unresolved past experience that is dubbed over your own conversation. Take time out before you react. It's likely the other person had no idea how his or her words have affected you. So take a few steps back and lend understanding to the situation. Have faith in your own connection and trust that you can come together. Take to a higher ground now and cultivate curiosity about what you observe in yourself, in others and in the landscape. You will find things that much improved sooner than you know. So this is your daily snapshot for the day. I do hope that you enjoy it. I do hope that you are going to apply it. Um, if you would like to have a personal reading, romancefultarot at gmail.com. Please don't forget to subscribe to the channel and stay tuned for the following reading, which is a love reading from our fairy godmothers. And uh, have a fantastic day. Many blessings. And we'll be seeing each other soon.